Hi everybody. Today I'm going to take you through a really quick but incredibly effective stretch break. If we haven't met before, my name is Dr. Lena Schulman. I am a chiropractor and a posture expert. So let's start off by shifting to the front of your chair and sitting up tall. So I'm going to have you put your hands either on the chair or on the arms of the chair with your elbows back. Just push down on the chair as you pull your shoulders away from your ears. You pull your head up to the ceiling, keep your chest wide. Take a deep breath, get some length. And from here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cross one leg over, grab that top leg, and just do a spinal twist. So please keep all that length that we created in your spine as you twist. I like to grab the back of my chair for leverage, but you can also grab the arm of your chair. Coming back to the center again, pushing down, pulling your shoulders down, creating some length as we cross the other leg over, grab it and twist in the opposite direction. So the reason we wanna create length is that picture when you're doing this stretch that you're wringing out a towel and pulling it longer at the same time to get the most length back in between your spine. And now from here, we're gonna do an amazing stretch for the back of the arm. And I'm just gonna have you take your hand up palm facing forward, arm in a 90 degree angle, and pull it across your body. These will get all those muscles that are getting overused as you're working on your computer. Feeling it in the back of the armpit, in the back of the shoulder. Switching arms, just gonna have you take your hand up again, looking at your palm, keeping your arm up, but try to keep the shoulder down. So you pull it across your body. One more deep breath. And now we're gonna stand up, so we're gonna shake our hands out. And I'm just gonna have you grab your arms behind your back, like this. If you can't do this, you can grab them like this, taking your shoulders away from your ears, taking your head off, one direction, left ear to the left shoulder, feeling it down the right side. Now we're gonna do the other side. Stretching out that left side of your neck, keeping these shoulders away from your ears as your chest stays open. And then, for our final stretch, we're gonna use the chair. So I mean, you can either grab, use the back of the chair or the seat of the chair. And you're gonna take your feet, about two or three feet back, depending on how tall you are, and your feet double or triple hips width apart. So a nice wide stance, hands on the chair, and I'm just gonna, with a straight spine, I'm just gonna to begin to shift my buttocks backwards as I shift my weight onto my heels. But you'll notice I'm keeping the front of my foot flat, so I'm not lifting my toes. I'm just shifting my weight backwards as my knees soften. And I'm picturing length as my tailbone's pulling back, my head is pulling forward, shifting back towards the wall behind me. And then if you're flexible enough to, you're just gonna drop your chest in between your shoulders and get that lovely stretch. Feeling in the back of my legs, the front of my chest. And then from here, all that we're gonna do is we're gonna bend the right knee and straighten the left leg. So we're gonna go over to the right I feel this stretch increase up my left inner thigh and in my left arm. Nice deep inner thigh stretch. Keep shifting your weight into the heels as you go side to side. Now we're gonna shift off to the left, bending the left knee, keeping the right leg straight, feeling this in my right arm. Spine stays long as my tailbone is reaching for the back wall. Coming back to the center. Just having one deep knee bend just to get those muscles moving. Coming back up, coming back up to the front of the chair and we're done. So I hope you like this quick stretch. Hopefully you feel much better to get back to your day. I really appreciate it if you'd click like below if you liked it and subscribe to our channel for more of these. Have a great day.